Street Talk! Yeah! Welcome to Street Talk. I am your host, Jason, and this is for Saturday, October the 11th. A lot of big matchups on Saturday, but I think this is probably the biggest of the day. Mississippi State Bulldogs hosting the Auburn Tigers. As you know, Auburn runner-up for the national title last year. Started out the year a little bit slow. Now really making a run and positioning themselves at the college football playoff. Led by their quarterback, Nick Marshall. He started out slow as well, but he's really sort of come into his own lately. Had his best game of the week last week. Passed for over 200 yards. Ran for over 100. And he leads the Tigers into Starkville, Mississippi. Stark Vegas! Against... Heisman hopeful Dak Prescott. Hopefully, you got your Heisman future bet in on Dak Prescott last week because he's going to be the favorite now with Gurley gone. I know some of you guys like to bet out there, but another future Heisman bet would be one on Nick Marshall too because probably the winner of this game's going to be in prime position to take the Heisman home in December. Well, Dak Prescott really coming into his own this year. His completion percentage is up by 10% this year. Interceptions only two. He's running the ball well. He's throwing the ball well. Showed a lot of poise versus Texas A&M. Didn't matter if one of his guys dropped the ball. He was just very cool, calm, and collected. Really doing great things in Mississippi State. They are also, the Bulldogs, also trying to beat their third straight top 10 team. That would be the first time in school history. Meanwhile, while Marshall's playing better, his completion percentage is down by 10% this year. So, that's up by 10, Nick's down by 10. Uh, Their running game's very good. Tigers run that high-powered offense, a lot of snaps, sort of similar to Oregon, trying to get as many snaps on the field as they can, led by Cameron Artis Payne. He has rushed for 594 yards this year. However, Mississippi State, Josh Robinson running back, run for 592 yards, except for he's done it in 31 less carries. So he has a chance to be explosive. Defensively, uh, Mississippi State, 11th in the nation versus the run. Auburn, 13th in the nation versus the run. Against the pass, Auburn is 33rd. However, Mississippi State, pretty far down versus the pass, 126. So not very good statistically versus the pass on defense. Well, what's it going to be? Can uh, Auburn come in, take this game, and really uh, have a shot at going back to the national title game again? They are two and a half point favorites on the road. But I think Mr. Prescott gets this done. I like Mississippi State in the mild upset mainly because I I rate these teams about the same. Auburn does have a little bit more of an experience factor dating back to last year. They are a little bit better versus the pass. However, I think with them being about the same, I think the tide is tipped, Mississippi State being at home. They beat A&M last week. They actually should have blown them out. The score wasn't really indicative of how well they played as A&M sort of scored a couple garbage touchdowns late. So, for me, Mississippi State for the green. I hope you guys enjoy it. We'll see you next time on Street Talk.